Today, we're breaking down the rig of none other than Joe Duplantier from Gojira. Let's get right into it and drill down on some of the gear Joe uses to craft those crushing riffs and soaring solos. First up, let's talk guitars. Joe is known for his distinctive sound, and here are a few of the axes he's been known to wield. Joe has been seen wielding the Jackson SLS-3, a sleek and sharp guitar that's perfect for his aggressive playing style. The SLS-3's slim body and fast neck make it ideal for the technical precision Joe brings to Gojira's music. The Jarvel, Joe Duplantier USA Signature Model Guitar is tailored to Joe's specifications, featuring a mahogany body and an ebony fingerboard. It's built for heavy riffs and smooth leads, just what you'd expect from a guitar bearing his name. Another signature model, the ProMod Sandemus, combines classic Charvel craftsmanship with modern features. With its comfortable body shape and powerful pickups, it's designed to handle anything Joe throws at it. The Gibson Custom Shop Explorer is a legendary guitar that delivers thunderous tones and a striking appearance. Its distinctive shape and heavy sound make it a staple in his lineup. And last but not least, the Flying V Gothic. This guitar is all about attitude and aesthetics, delivering a fierce look and even a fiercer sound. Joe uses it to bring an extra layer of intensity to Gojira's music. Now, let's move on to amplifiers. Joe's tone is massive, and that's in part thanks to some of the amplifiers he uses. Known for its high gain and versatility, the EVH 5153 is a perfect match for Joe's heavy, dynamic playing style. It's capable of everything from crushing rhythms to searing leads. Now, let's get onto the pedal board. Joe's pedal setup is key to his unique sound, providing both precision and versatility. These pedals will be listed in the order they would most likely be found on a pedal board. Keeping things in tune is essential, especially with the complex and demanding riffs he plays. The Boss TU-3 is a reliable tuner that ensures every note is spot on. He also uses the Digitech WH-5 Whammy for pitch shifting and harmonizing effects, adding a unique flavor to his solos and riffs. It's a staple for many modern guitarists and a key part of Joe's sound. When he needs a bit more drive, he turns to the KHDK number no. one overdrive. This pedal adds a smooth, warm overdrive that enhances his tone without overpowering it. For a bit more grit and aggression, the KHDK Electronic School Screamer Overdrive is another one of Joe's go-to overdrive pedals. It's versatile with multiple settings to fine-tune the drive, making it perfect for Gojira's dynamic sound. With high gain comes noise, and the MXR M135 Smart Gate is here to tame it. It keeps Joe's sound tight and controlled, even at the highest gain settings. Another noise control tool, the Boss NS2 Noise Suppressor, ensures his rig stays silent when he needs it to be, eliminating unwanted hum and buzz. For those lush analog delay sounds, Joe uses the MXR M169 Carbon Copy. It adds depth and space to his playing, perfect for creating atmospheric textures. The DC Electronic Flashback Delay offers a wide range of delay tones, from vintage echoes to modern digital repeats. It's incredibly versatile and a key part of his effects arsenal. To round out his sound, he relies on the TC Electronic Hall of Fame reverb. It provides everything from subtle room ambiance to vast cathedral-like reverbs, giving his tone extra dimension. So there you have it, many of the weapons that can be found in Joe Duplantier's arsenal. The gear he uses is as impressive and complex as his music. From guitars to pedals to amps, every piece plays a crucial role in shaping his unique sound. If you enjoyed this rundown, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on our next gear deep dive. Thanks for supporting the channel.